Welcome to Employment Law This Week. I'm George Whipple. Employers are adjusting COVID policies following updated guidance from the CDC. In light of vaccinations, boosters, and immunity following infection, the agency is now recommending that all individuals, regardless of vaccination status, who suspect exposure to COVID-19, wear a mask for 10 days rather than quarantine. During the 10-day period, individuals should monitor symptoms and test on day five, regardless of symptoms. Many states follow CDC guidance, but some have their own guidelines. So employers are checking requirements in their locations and updating policies to remain in compliance. While COVID-19 requirements seem to be easing, employers are closely watching the most recent public health emergency, monkeypox. The CDC has released information for healthcare professionals, but there has been no federal monkeypox guidance for the general workplace as of this filming. Monkeypox is a known virus with available, although limited, vaccines. The virus most likely spreads through prolonged face-to-face or skin-to-skin contact. Employers have a general duty to provide a safe work environment under the Occupational Safety and Health Act and should keep monitoring the CDC for any future guidance. EEO-1 pay data reporting requirements could be coming soon. EEOC Commissioner Keith Sunderling's recent announcement that pay data reporting is coming is the latest indication that EEO-1 Component 2 data will be required in the future. This means employers would once again have to report compensation data categorized by race, sex, ethnicity, and more. While Component 2 does not require pay equity audits, many employers are conducting them now in order to uncover potential disparities that could lead to litigation and enforcement. This topic will be covered at Epstein Becker Green's annual Workforce Management Briefing, where Commissioner Sunderling will also be a featured speaker. That's it for this week. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you next time.